What was that plane ride like? Regular plane ride. Right, that's it. Just get Just home. Quiet. Yeah. No, I wasn't quiet. You know, you're talking, but it's a regular plane ride. You've, been, you've played, obviously, with, with great quarterbacks, obviously, Ben's later years and Mahomes last year and obviously the San Diego days. Did Tua yesterday even raise your expectations of how good he can be? I know you had confidence in him as your teammate, but did it raise your, your level of, oh, my goodness, this guy could be really good? No. He uh, always had confidence in him. I'm not going to let one game come out and be like, oh, no, oh, he could be this good. No, nah, we always knew he could be good. Well, we we gonna we're not gonna let one game define that he did he went out and did what we all knew he could do and we all expect him to do. It's not a raising no confidence. No, he was just out there playing his game. Ben, what did you think about the defense in the fourth quarter? The first first half definitely didn't go your way, but uh, that especially on that fourth and one stop, but the whole fourth quarter. What did you think about the way the defense played? Oh, I think we played good. I think we got some areas we can clean up, but we definitely played good. We just out there trying to make plays to get the offense the ball back. Any big plans for the off day? No. Chill. Get back in the drawing boards. We got Buffalo coming in here. Go in and watch some film, get some body work done, and, and get ready to go. What excites you most about going up a team against a team like Buffalo just because they are the Super Bowl favorites? <laughs> I didn't even know they were the Super Bowl favorites, but I wouldn't say nothing to excite me. It's another team on our schedule, man. And, and, and when you got another team on your schedule, you got to go in and prepare and get ready to try to win a football game. I, I wouldn't say it. nothing excites me more about playing them. How quickly What's, do you have to turn the page after such a big win in terms of you know the opponent you'll be facing? How quickly you start thinking, OK, that's over. Now it's Buffalo. 24-hour rule. Win or lose, it's a 24-hour rule. Never get too high, never get too low. Challenge a rushing, rushing the passer with a good running quarterback. You'll have a second in a row with Josh Allen. What, what's, what's that extra challenge as opposed to a, a guy who stands in the pocket more? Uh, it's definitely a challenge when you got a quarterback that can, can move around back there. And Josh Allen is really one of the best quarterbacks in this league right now as far as running and throwing. And, and he, he does it all. So you got to try to just cancel out every phase, really. Got to have, have good rush lanes and, and try to play complimentary football. Now, what's your attitude on regular season games? Are there games that you circled, whether it's a division game or a, a team that you used to play against or no. any reason? Or I circle every game. <laughs> they all mean the same, really. I circle every game. Will you watch the uh, Buffalo game tonight? I watch football every day. Yeah. It ain't just because Buffalo playing. I watch. I always watch football. Yeah. Your favorite player other than yourself? I wouldn't say. Nah, probably myself. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>